Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to sync audio in Adobe Premiere Pro. Sometimes you may have recorded audio on a separate recorder and now you have to sync that audio to the video. The best example is music videos. On set, you are using a playback speaker, but whatever audio the camera is recording will not be used because you have to link the video to the original sound. There are three fast ways you can use to sync audio to video in Adobe Premiere Pro. The first and fastest way is to put the original audio into the same folder where your video clips are, then select everything in that folder. You can press Ctrl A on your keyboard to select all, right click, go to create mount camera source sequence. On the settings window, just select audio and track channel, select mix down and press OK. Premiere Pro will sync all your video clips to original audio in seconds automatically. When it's done, all your video and audio are in sync. It will create a folder of the clips it has synced called processed clips. It will also create another sequence. Right click on that sequence and go to open in timeline and here they are perfectly synced. Select all of them or press Ctrl A to select all, right click then go to unlink, then delete the audio from the camera, leave the original audio and you are good to start editing. The second way to sync audio is to create a sequence first. Let's go to the project window, then create a new sequence. Drag all your clips to the timeline, one on top of another, then put the original audio as well. After that, select all the clips, Control A, right click, then go to synchronize. On the settings window, select audio and track channel, put mix down and press OK. It will sync all your audio automatically. And when it's done, select all the clips, right click, then go to unlink, then delete all unwanted audio and leave the original audio. Before I go on to the third method, if you're gonna use one of the methods that I have just shown you now, make sure the sound that your camera records is loud enough for the software to recognize it. But if for some reasons, maybe you are shooting a music video and there is a lot of wind, or maybe you are using a phone as a playback speaker, the artist can hear the song, but maybe the camera can't catch much of the song. That's when we can use the next method. This third method is manual, actually. Now, this is how I do it. Let me show you. First, let me delete these ones in the timeline. Then I'll start by adding the original audio on the timeline. Play it a bit to get a mark. All right, where it says Sonde, that's my mic. Then I'll go to the videos in the projects window double click to open it in the source monitor then play the clip from the beginning when i reach where the song says sonde there so press mark in or press i on the keyboard then drag the video only and put it next to the playhead where i paused the original audio and it will be in sync after that let's do the second one double click play it from the beginning where you just Let's hear Sonde, that's the mark. Stop the clip, put a mark in, and drop the video where the other one begins and it's in sync. This type of manual syncing is when you are using one camera to take multiple clips of the same video, like a music video. But if you are doing a match cam setup, Maybe it is an interview where you have three cameras that are set up. Start rolling on the cameras and clap before they start speaking to create a mark that you're gonna use for syncing 
audio in the post production what is is about what is is about as i've said uh, mrs club is all about empowering women yes this is it on syncing audio in adobe premiere pro there are other many ways of syncing audio uh, including using third party plugins like plural eyes and many more others but these ones will always make your work faster i'll see you in the next video this is it peace